So thoughts, predictions as we move forward into uh, the final live match of the night? I think Rafa is still the favourite just because of the amount of um, control that he can exercise on the map. I, I feel that CZM has hit great shots, he's done certain like you know magical moments, but he hasn't really just kind of like said this is my map and you can't do anything on mm -hmm. it. And you know, and and because that way the frags just come so so easy because you don't have any uh, any of the map to use. Uh, he hasn't really done that. He's hit fantastic railguns. Um, but he's going to need all of these factors to align to be able to beat Rafa. Yeah. Rafa, on the other hand, needs to just, you know, this is Rafa. Be Rafa. This just needs to be Rafa. And then so it's definitely possible for CZM to take it. The question I is, uh, w where are they going to play it? <laughs> so yeah, Rafa is chilling on the server, so I'll keep an eye on that. And if you see them hop out or something, then we'll, we'll follow. But uh, we do need CZM to hopefully hop in. Uh, maybe they are, um, I don't know, doing some ritual backstage, preparing for this one. You know, it's it's the uh, American showdown. Yep. Yep. And uh, of course, if you are watching, picks. Yeah, they are picking maps now, but we're uh, wait with them. But of course, if you are watching and you're wondering where you could find more in of me and Greece Scotsman, I of course am on Twitter. <laughs> I'm trying to get <laughs> more than more followers than Joe Miller. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rafa just hopped off, and my I see CGM My Twitter. <laughs> let me finish. Uh -huh. Is at follow two GD, and it's the best Twitter you ever follow. It really is. Everyone who follows it lives a much more beautiful life. Yeah. Frankly, they message me and go, "My life after I followed you on Twitter, it's amazing." So you try it. Money back guaranteed. I I think I'm gonna follow, follow too good. I don't know if you deserve the good life, Greece. Oh, really? Wow. Af after after all it's this. Pretty exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me go check my Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> all right, CCM and Rafa have actually joined the server, and uh, they've hopped in. So I think we're getting pretty close to go time. Do we do we actually have map picks? Are you actually gonna look at IRC to to see the map picks? Second. Yes, my my co-host is being difficult, so I'm asking the players for the map picks. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. T7 and arrow, and followed by toxic or toxicity. If we have a tiebreaker. <laughs> Alrighty, thank you, Rafa, for being a stand-up gentleman. Uh, so actually, both these guys are stand-up gentlemen, in my humble opinion. Uh. I think th you know the, the the Quake community um, can have a bit of a rough edge around it, where these guys are kind of like diamonds in the rough. Uh, really cool, nice, funny guys. Um, Who's diamonds in the rough? Rafa CZM. What? They're they're nice people. But most gamers are jerks. Most, <laughs> most gamers are jerks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a king jerk, thank you very much. <laughs> You're going to address me, you shall call me king jerk. <laughs> yes, alright. <coughs> uh, Brendan Jancy says his life is better after following Tugas. Welcome to the good life. Alrighty. So, yes. Is, is that who they wrote the song about? Is it you? Was it you? The, the Good Life song? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All songs are written about me. <laughs> I don't know. Even the... Uh, yeah, even the bad ones. Even the incestuous country? Yep. I, I could see that. Alright. So, Not I think... To me. I think we need to say all set here before... I don't know. I, I think that's what we need, because I don't even know what time it is, but we've been doing this for several hours straight, and I'm getting kind of loopy. It's good. Kind of. Good point. Good point. Fair enough. Yeah, cause, you know, most, most broadcasters take breaks. We're not here for the time. Eric Collins <laughs> from Dorset <laughs> says, My life has now improved by 200%. I'm following too good. Thank you, Kate. Not a problem, Eric. I'm here to spread the joy. And 
happiness and improve lives for many. I like that his tweet was opportune. He's clearly listening. All right, so we let these guys warm up just a little bit more. Uh, we'll talk a little bit more about Furious Heights, James. Yeah, uh, we could, or we could talk about Johnny Turner, <laughs> aka Rat Tackle. My life expectancy just doubled after following two years. Prepare to fight. All these things and more could be yours on Twitter. Here we go. Three, All right. two, so we're going to live finally. Okay. Fight. <laughs> we have Rapid spawning RL up to Mega, and he'll head straight for the LG. CCM will meet him there with Plasma without an RL of his own. Won't be too punished for it. Uh, but of course, he did get the RA and actually did not pick up the Y on the other side. So uh, that'll be a nice gift. Yeah, definitely a be better start here for uh, Rafa. And uh, with red armor up, as long as Rafa can get into the room without taking any damage, which he's going to do, that red will be his. Looking for actually some additional damage uh, before he takes the red with the uh, railgun shot. Nice move by Rafa. And he's all over the map right now. I mean, CZM doesn't really have a look in whatsoever. I wonder yeah. if he's following my Twitter. Doesn't look like it. <laughs> but I know if Rafa only, is. if only before this match, yeah. Oh wow, he could have been living the good life. So Rafa now looking completely dominant, uh, timing position on everything. He's actually looking again for damage. He really wants to punish CZM for uh, not being here, uh, not having the ability to even contest anything. Um, over to CZM in just a second. I want to make sure this exchange ends. Okay, CZM with 62 armor and 100 health. Finally, has all the weapons that he wants, but yeah, look at that. Rafa can just muscle his way into the room. Very unlucky. Uh, Rafa, very unlucky not to hit the uh, the railgun shot. CCM actually going to come in with some damage of his own, but he really doesn't have an in on this red. So CCM kind of just losing a little bit of his own health and armor uh, to eventually, I think, die. Yeah, and, uh, say, uh, dropping it on the yellow. Thoughts on that? Uh, let's talk about what's going on now, but of course, I think Rafa's going to get the kill. That one's going to be uh, pretty tied up nice and easy. Raph has got good timing on the uh, on the red and mega. So this looks really bad for CZM. Luckily for him, Raph has run out of uh, the rocket launcher. He's got a real gun. Uh, for him, got a real gun, yeah. But still, Indeed. CZM could make something happen here with no rocket launcher. Raph. Nice uh, from Raph to open up that shot. He's going to win himself a mega. Congratulations. You've won a mega. And CCM doesn't have the RA to fall back on. He will only have the 50 armor that Raph has completely destroyed away with his lightning gun. And Raph is looking for blood here, dropping in on the item. Does he have a little bit of rocket damage, but not much. And it looks like pretty much uh, CCM will get away. So, you know, 26 health, kind of lucky to, to get away. <laughs> yep. Leave your Twitter alone. Man. I Come on. I'm not on Twitter. You're on Twitter, idiot. <laughs> Right, CZM, yeah, definitely uh, just having to kind of well, run around and, and get what he can, and that's actually the first big pickup he's got. He's yeah. got to be very careful here about defending from Rafa coming in from top, which is exactly what he does, and Rafa will push him away from that yellow armor pickup. Now, not much on the map for these players to gain apart from the weapons, and the only one who needs it is CZM. He needs the railgun. Not going to be able to get it. He's probably not going to be able to get on the, the yellow all the red without meeting Rafa somewhere and that's exactly what Rafa does, he stays in the middle and uh, CCM does take the red before dying and that's actually quite important maybe that will play come into a factor next time they meet but of course Rafa no problems here picking up the frag, no problems catching CCM and a 3-0 lead has looked pretty easy and this red armor, CZM can't be there, can't be anywhere. He's going to look for maybe some plasma. And he does have finally a rocket launcher. Um, on the recovery, he has been able to, he does have an LG finally going up to get that. But uh, as far as what's available to him, nothing is. And nothing will be for another five seconds. Uh, he'll have to maybe figure out where Rafa's going to go and try to not be there. Yeah, CZM taking middle ground. It's always nice if you're on the defense to you know, hold either the top middle or bottom middle where CZM is now because you can, you know, defend quite well and do a lot of damage. Of course, you know, this defense has worked out well so far. There's a 50 health. Gotta watch out for... Ooh, he's a little bit flustered there, CZM. He's not really in control of, of everything. In terms, it didn't look very good, but of course he did get away. He did do the damage he wanted. 
and he has put himself somewhat closer to uh, a chance at taking Rafa off this one. But personally, it's all about Rafa. Um, I can't see CZM doing too good even in this situation. As he just eats a, a little bit of LG. Nice railgun on the defense, but I don't think it's going to equate to much. He needs a couple of more of those railguns. And there's a, almost a direct rocket. That could have been huge. But somehow CZM just counts down and Rafa's like, well, okay, you know, I'll, I'll go get all the other items and I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> I'll get back to you later. Uh, yeah, so CZM has been able to survive that, but, you know, what, what benefit did he get? Really not much. He's got 75 armor, so Rafa, I think, made the perfect choice to just run away because now, quite frankly, he can decide when to punish. And CZM has had no option, although that's a nice connection with the rail. The question is, can CZM follow up? No, and you can see him, uh, maybe a little bit of frustration there with his mouse movement. Uh, as Rafa is able to pick up track number four and surely another one here as, uh, as you know, no, nowhere for CZM to go. Five yeah. I mean, CZM really hasn't you know, been hitting anything this game. Uh, I'm just going to check over. It's like 20% Rogan, 21% LG. Yeah. Um, he's not been able to work any of his weapons. And plus, maybe credit as well to Rafa because he really is good at cutting out, you know, threats of, you know, high... Um, he has strong aim players. Mm -hmm. You know, he's had to deal with, you know, the best in that all the way through. But look at that. Yeah. Rafa actually blocking the door with grenades. Yeah. Um, and then CZM getting a little bit flustered. Doesn't get through the door. Rafa drops down. Gets the railgun kill. 6-0. I don't even think CZM's going to get a frag this whole match. Quite, a, quite so a prediction. But uh, I'm I, 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 I have hopes for, for, you know, something. we got four minutes left. And CCM still looking for some sort of in. He does not have a railgun. This might be kind of what he's peeking around. He wants to pick a, a red armor fight. The question is, Rafa, though, is he able to, he able to get the armor? Can he get out cleanly? Oh, wow, he's just going for blood. Yeah, but CZM doesn't, you know, have the weapons to finish that like fight. A rail. He's got LG and a yeah. one rocket right now. So even though Rafa should be in a lot of trouble, um, he wasn't so much earlier. But there is the frag that I wasn't sure if CZM was going to be able to pull off, and he has taken it. And you know, just so, so quickly, as, you know, as it's quake, momentum has swung, and uh, definitely in favour of CZM, if he was able to actually do a little bit more damage, nice. swung. I'm not sure what I said. Oh, no. um, yeah. Nice rails from Rafa, though, crippling CZM <laughs> down to 10 health. I just realised that. Um, <laughs> Oh, and he missed the plasma climb. Uh-oh, really? Uh-oh. Oh, no. You got it, dude. Come on, let's give him... Uh, He's obviously been boot camping with Tony, and that's why he's able to be this far in the tournament. That's a Tony move. I've seen that uh -huh. before, so yeah. well done, CZM, you that's sly old dog. Yeah. So, Rafa, I mean, that basically, you know, momentum gone, Rafa back uh, in the throne, basically. Uh, I wouldn't say in the throne at all, yeah. I but mean, but he's only a little bit ahead, and I think CZM is going to be able to knock him off. He has all the weapons he needs. Um, there's no big item spawning, so it's all about who can do what damage um, in the next, you know, kind of five seconds. If they want to trade, I'm, I'm, I'm happier for CZM because he's got Mega uh, where he is, and he's even actually going to extend himself to try and do some damage over at the red. Doesn't do so. He's not covering uh, the entrance there, so that's a little bit risky. Um, but either way, CZM definitely looking that he can get the frag. But of course, five frags. Two minutes. That's what he we're asking from him. Yes. And versus Rafa, you know, it's harder versus Rafa than anyone else, basically. Pretty much. Yeah. It, it'll it'll take longer. You might get there, but it'll be too late. CCM having to press the fight and fix a pretty good one. He's able to. Yeah. I mean, he, CCM hit a lot of LG, but Rafa able to answer in kind. And CCM now, of course, down and out. Yeah. Seven one eight eighteen on the clock. Rafa just gonna finish it up. Have to expend all his LG. I was gonna, I was gonna be really scared for CDM if he didn't win that fight there after picking up YA. Seven to two. Um, so accuracy wise, you know, we've seen in the games where CZM did really well. He had something like a 60% rail. Here we're seeing he's got a 20% rail, and it seems like Rafa has never given him an angle for an opening. And any any major mistakes that you've seen from Rafa? Not really. Um, He's, he's definitely 
Oh, yeah, well, he did outplay. I think CZM's just not as good as the map as Rafa. I think he's as good as, as a player in One terms of aim. Mm -hmm. But when Rafa's so far ahead of his experience on this map, it's really shown. I, I want to see CZM play Arrow Walk because that's the map that he can take. And then, you know, if he can get, you know, top six feet, you know, that would be great for him. But this one, I think, was uh, almost, I wouldn't say a sure loss. But it pretty much was, you know, it would look like it, but it felt like it, and, you know, it was always uh, the chance it would have been, but, you know, Rafa is, um, good at controlling, so, you know, yeah. DM13, if that came into the mix a little bit later, I'd be more happy with that map than this one, uh, for CZM, so, he's definitely not out of it, despite his performance not being great here, I just think he needs, a uh, error walk. But even then, Rafa's you know, so good on every single map, so, yeah, you know. And, yeah, Flawless uh, Double Rock attempts to take high ground. Very nice maneuver by Rafa to get him a kill, and there it is. 10 to 2 is the final score of that one. And, uh, you know, quite frankly, Rafa looking pretty good now. Uh, Rafa on form for, uh, for the big show on, I guess it would be Saturday at this, at this point? Yeah, he looks like he, it, but, look, but look at the um, stats there, like, not only did CZM hit less accuracy on some of the most important weapons, like the, the railgun exclusively, I would say, um, being the most important for him, um, he even fired less than Rafa, so he wasn't even able to play the map well enough to get on the railgun, and that's that's really an experience. So this map, he's going to be able to get the weapons he wants, CZM, he's going to be able to, you know, constantly get into fights, so he's got a real big chance to bring it back to 1-1. One, one. I, I hope so, and I mean I've seen CZM do amazing things on this map. Uh, I think most people, you know, like, like you're suggesting, this is kind of his home. Uh, the question is, you know, can he um, evict Rafa? So I'm gonna let them know, of course, that we are all set, yeah. and I don't even have to. We're going live. Never mind that. And I hope that CZM isn't, you know, shaken uh, by his performance in the last game. I hope he doesn't feel like too outclassed, even though he definitely was received in the G and show us the uh, famous moments he gives us on this map of Arrow War. Already doing some nice work, but Rafa picks up first blood with the shotgun. Three HP, but CZM. There's the railgun in the hand of the man that can use it, and. Uh, Beautiful thing. Indeed. Um, <laughs> well, we, we just need <laughs> to see some, some, uh, some quad <laughs> rail runs tomorrow like, out of him. That's all. That's all we need. Uh, Look at that yeah. Shot. yeah, beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. I mean, I'm, I'm you know, getting pumped up for this one because uh, TCM's looking a lot more comfortable, a lot more at home. Yep. And oh, oh yeah, there's two to one. So. Well, we're thinking about Rocket jumping out then, TCM. So he's actually going to do it. Just a little bit later. He's got to be careful, he's actually down on health compared to Rafa now. And Rafa has the uh, 225. CZM needs a railgun shot to do it, but not going to happen. And uh, Rafa will win that one. So a uh, little bit sloppy there from CZM. Um, you know, shouldn't have taken that fight by any means. Maybe could have worked the bottom um, area with um, the railgun more so than go around the top. But looking for the surprise factor. Instead got killed because of it. So 2-2 two -two scoreline. Just a one minute gone, so real fast game so far. CCM no armor, and no armor available for him over there. Rafa, 84 armor. Wow, oh, nice. a grenade railgun combo. Yeah. He could be rolled off the map as he jumps over to the red. But luckily he gets on it. And once uh, CCM gets this yellow, I think he's going to feel pretty comfortable yeah. uh, to, uh, to play this one out. Oh, and with that rocket. Nice rocket. Yeah. Had that been a rail combo, I think that would have been almost the end of Rafa. Yeah, absolutely. And oh, oh, nice. Jeez, again, you know, Rafa, nice of all move. people to be caught out, CZM is really doing a great job. And there's oh, one rail, nice. 18 health for Rafa. Uh, as CZM makes his exit, he will... Oh, actually, he misses the jump to red. Let's see if this becomes a consequential thing. No, not really. Why? Well, Although Mega... Be because Mega, Mega's out. Yep, Rafa yep. going to rocket jump out of the, uh, the red area there. CZM does take the Mega. We've got the yellow armor up. CCM looking to pick up the yellow as well. Nice uh, use of the teleporter to get to the yellow quicker and get the uh, the green armor. So basically, they did take 100 armor each, but CCM did get the um, like mega. So he is in the lead, but of course, very hard to lock Rafa down. He's got a hand on higher ground, spamming rockets successfully and getting the red. And actually, not taking the red, he actually came off the platform to do damage. And uh, that was a, a nice little move from Rafa, but I'm not even sure. You know, we um, wanted to, to not take the red in that situation, but he came off the perfect time to be able to land and get a shot of a good rocket off 
but now we could be in trouble. Let's find out. Railgun uh, versus Railgun here. This is the longest standoff that I've seen <laughs> over this red armor. He's going to keep walking away and coming back. Uh, he was able to wait it out long enough to, in order to pick up Mega. Now finally, it's like yellow armor's up. Rafa will only have the RA to, to, to work with. And CZM, of course, is having uh, perfect timing on the Mega. I don't think Rafa was a good shot and knew when CZM nice. decided to go get it. Good well done from Rafa. Nice going to shut down CZM, but CZM goes in with a grenade. And that's going to even him up uh, very much so on the health and armor. There's another nice railgun from Rafa, but TCM works his way in on the red. One good rocket, two good rockets. He's going to look for the railgun on the exit. And Rafa's already gone. He's, uh, he's out of there, but still he's not out of danger. CCM looking to chase, do a little bit more damage. Rafa only with 103 total uh, health and armor. A little bit more now, and CCM hits a direct rocket. Rafa is in trouble, gives up the frag. And uh, CCM looking to control the map, and this is what you can do as CCM on this map with that railgun. He already gets the, the initial shot, gets the kill, goes uh, in the lead, 4-2, to two, now 5-2, to two, takes the Mega. Red Armor's going to be spawning, doesn't see Rafa at the moment, so he's going to assume he's over by the Yellow Armor railgun area. Rafa has got the rail, goes for the Yellow Armor. CZM happy to give that one away to hold a position, and look at that flick railgun shot. CZM playing so, so good. He's up to 45% railgun, gets another kill. Doesn't get the spawn, but just constantly putting pressure, and just, um, this is the CZM that we love to see on this map. Oh, absolutely. And, you know, you, you know, Rafa hasn't been able to demonstrate, you know, the kind of uh, dominance and control and, and in map knowledge over CZM that he uh, did prior to this map. So that's a good start, oh, wow. but CZM's able to defend himself, gets away with 58 health and picks up a Y immediately, and off the spawn hits Rafa with a rail, already has him screaming. And there's a great finish, 8 to 2. He'll have uh, RA coming up in just a few seconds, but he's pretty weak, so a lot of nades spam to make sure that Rafa doesn't get anywhere near him. Uh, with a long range shot from that corridor. Rafa's gonna go with gangbusters and get the kill. And uh, I have to say, I, I love the timing of, yeah. of these frags. Both these guys, when they decided to go in for the kill, uh, it's been a op very opportune moment for them. One health from CCM as he left that fight there. Wow. And uh, of course, we are now uh, over half time, five minutes ago. You know, not much uh, difference in the frag, actually, only now four frags is a difference. And Rafa, you know, he's the one that's in control. CCM comes in. Looking to do what Rafa did earlier, but you know, not as um, <laughs> you know, little, yeah, not as successfully. But of course, you know, not as sneaky. Uh, but he didn't need to do it as sneaky. But of course, couldn't hit the rockets. Gonna get shut down. Loses out on another frag. Gets a horrible spawn. Wow. And you know, does give Rafa a bit of a run around. Does take the yellow. <laughs> Rafa's like, can you, okay. can you just lay down and die? Because this is all very tiring and it's very late here. Wait, wow. one. Uh, Great shot. Nice uh, railgun shot, yeah. So CZM is very much crippled in terms of health and armor. Yeah, so Rafa's basically uh, put, to, uh, put together a nice little comeback in the last, what, minute and a half? And uh, now it's a two frag game. Yeah, and, and CTM hasn't really been playing that great when he's been so low on off and armor. Like he's he's very defensive and runny, um, as opposed to kind of sneaky snipey. <laughs> I <laughs> know, uh, no, that's a weird way to describe Quake. Oh, um, no. oh my god, catching CZM, doing the jump to the red, and ties us up at 8-8. Yeah, CZM when he's low definitely plays, you know, very defensive to hold on to that point, as opposed to other players that will maybe kind of risk their, um, you know, help uh, just to get, you know, a couple of sneaky railgun shots off, and even if they die, they're like, well, oh well, at least I've still with 125 health, but CZM does sometimes hold on to his health a little too long and it doesn't help him out, but here we go, 9 to 8. Certainly no, um, no reason to criticize even player at the moment. It's CZM baits in oh, wow. Rafa and then changes up to the uh, rocket launcher at the last moment to tie us back up up to 9 to 9. Mega was taken by Rafa. Yellow armor is going to be spawning soon. CZM doesn't have the railgun, but hits a great rocket shot. Hits another right. one onto the yellow. He's going to get the railgun now. LG is good enough in this situation. Doesn't go for the railgun, and that's a real smart move because Rafa would assume that he would have, which would have given him a second to get out of this uh, 
um, area, but because CGM didn't get the roll, he actually got the kill. That's such a little nice decision there that does make, again, all the differences in Quake Live. 10 to 9, one fragment, one fragment in favor of CGM, now the two, now the Mega. He's surely going to want to get himself the Railgun now, and he's already done enough damage to kill uh, Rafa quite easily with a Railgun shot. Unfortunate to miss it, Rafa very sneakily actually came back in with the Rockets, and very unlucky to get taken down. That was a good move by Rafa to kind of uh, double back onto a CGM. That could have surprised him and got him the counter kill, but CGM holds strong, holds the frags, free the difference. Everything to play for for both players, but maybe more so for CDM as he needs this one to go 1-1 one, one to put us into a final map, and I'm sure that's what everybody wants here at Quake That's what I want, that is definitely for sure. And uh, I was, I was going to take a look and see what Rafa was going to do on the recovery, but uh, right now he is hurting. That's the rail that will help him out, but with only 41 health, CDM is coming in for the kill. And Rafa's able to defend himself with 13 health and get the RA off of that. Now, Mega not spawning for 20 seconds, so CZM, if he can get weapons, can be a threat. Yeah, yeah he's Rafa. got a railgun. He's just yeah. got to be careful because uh, Rafa's looking for him to, to look for a sniping shot. Rafa's yeah. only got 12 HP right now. Picks up the yellow. Uh, 25 as well. Over to Rafa. There comes a one railgun shot that if he had earlier. Could have gotten the kill. But either way, done a lot of damage. But now Rafa gets the mega, but eats another ray railgun. CZM does rock a jump onto the red. This could be dangerous. CZM has no way to defend himself. Has to give up the frag, but he has denied a very big power up. But CZM, I don't think, has the best spawn here. Gets himself the um, the rail, and I think we're going to see CZM just try and hold position and, and rail Rafa. You know, he's going to have to give up the red, but he's going to try and get a couple of uh, bits of damage on to Rafa. So it's essentially just a back away. defensive distance. Yeah, real defensive. Yeah. Oh, oh we're at a great opener, though. Oh, no. Though. This is bad for CTM. Yeah. Oh, Rafa's down. able to put him down. Oh, well. And there's plenty of time to get this frag as Rafa's going in for the kill. And I like that, again, you know, we've seen Rafa not get too greedy. Yeah, but this is anyone's game now because CGM has yellow armor available. He has the health backup, you know, and and Rafa you know, has the red, but it's not too much um, of it. But CGM didn't go for the yellow. That's insane. Wow. Like he could have taken it. And he could have been in a really good position, but now he's you know he's limping right now. He's you know he anything will take him down. He's only got a hundred health. Now he's got twenty health. He's pushing for an overtime, oh! but Rafa it's not gonna it. give it to him. Rafa comes in, gets the kill, and Rafa says no overtime, <laughs> no grand finals for you. Wow. Why didn't CZN make the move for that yellow armor? I do not know. Wow. But either way, Rafa from SK Gaming goes into the grand finals here at QuakeCon 2011. He will be playing strengths on day three, which will be the final day. We've got TDM tomorrow where we'll find out who's going to be in the TDM finals. But it is, you know, confirmed. Rafa yeah. versus strengths. Indeed. And... Th and th there's there's literally there's literally just a hundred damage difference uh, in in damage dealt between those two in that matchup. That was ridiculous. I mean, of the two styles, just oh god, amazing game. I I don't really have words anymore because a I'm tired and b that was awesome. So my brain is just fried uh, with with Quake Live completely. Um, so we have yeah team deathmatch tomorrow and the start time for that. Is 12? Okay, 12, 12 noon here. Uh, that's a central time, uh, US. So I guess do the math for uh, for whatever it is uh, for the the Europeans. And I guess we just need to, to sign off because James is already going to sleep. Nah, man. Nah, uh, you're good. Party time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, now are you gonna stay up with me and, and do demos? What do you think? Yeah. No. Okay. Well, we'll decide that later. So what we're gonna do is. Uh, I'm going to take a short break. <laughs> Shaking I think we're no. done. This is it. Well, I'm going to take a short break. You're going to take a short break. What am I doing? I don't know. But I'm going to take a long break. Yes. Like, I'm going to be back tomorrow. <laughs> exactly. And that's fine. But I'm going to take a short break because I want to uh, keep covering some of the demo footage that we have of these players. And uh, I don't know if I've gotten confirmation that we have that stuff uploaded yet. But uh, I just basically want to keep going. I want to show games that uh, we weren't able to cover. I'm going to pick a couple from the playoffs, uh, hopefully some some uh, three mappers, and uh, we're going to stream out some additional content that we could not cover earlier. So, yep. uh, 
I'll be back in a few minutes, and you'll probably see James tomorrow. Yeah, and uh, congratulations again uh, to Rafa from SK Gaming. Um, you know, going in the grand finals versus uh, Fnatic Strength. That's going to be a, a massive game. But of course, we've got Cooler. Uh, we'll be playing um, uh, CZM, and uh, that's a, a big, big game. And congratulations to CZM. That's a really good showing for him. Yeah. And uh, you know, I think EG will be happy that you know he did what he did. And I think that Arrow Warp was his to win. Very unfortunate not to take it. And uh, you know, I just think his defensive style sometimes a little bit too passive yeah you know so uh, maybe if he took a, a little bit more risk he could have uh, pushed us into a third map but either way Rafa definitely deserved it so Absolutely. thanks for watching us here at QuakeCon on day one for the duel Steve will be back in a moment I'll see you tomorrow p potentially maybe follow me on Twitter I don't know I'll come back if you don't follow me I'll come back as well good to know so I get both people have a good night folks keep everyone happy watch more Quake